Let's talk a little bit about the, uh, the platform here, because obviously all eyes and what happened yesterday, it really kind of looked like a fiasco, what was going on. You got the platform, it doesn't include uh, Jerusalem as the capital of Israel, it doesn't include God, the language in the platform there. And a, a lot of people are not buying this argument that this was some sort of technical error, but that this was really deliberate. How did that happen? Well, I, I have no idea how the drafting platform uh, had this omission. I, I don't. That's not something uh, that, was, that I was involved in. Uh, but I will say this. I'm proud that we have a president of the United States, uh, the leader of his party, who's willing to say, hey, put it back in. Uh, that platform does not reflect my values. It does not reflect my policies. I love that. All those delegates in favor say aye. All those delegates. Well, what uh, happened on the floor? Because uh, well, a lot of people looked at that uh, and they said, the governor, they, they didn't hear governor two straight. Well, you that guess times, what? That, voice that was my decision. And I'll, t I'll tell was you. Was that the right decision? Because a lot of people didn't agree it with that. It was decision. the right decision. I gave people three opportunities. Let me do that again. See? I knew we had a majority both times. Uh, by the third one, uh, I said it's time to make a decision. And I opined uh, and feel very comfortable about it that there was a two thirds vote. Now, you should know something. People, every delegate has a right to protest. They have 10 minutes to protest. Not one person protested. So what do you make of the fact that some people, some people who were there do not agree with you and they believe that this is something that was kind of rammed through because of the political sensitivity to the issue here, that the, it really wasn't two thirds that was, that was in support of this? Well, like I said, uh, I had to make that decision. I made it. I gave people three different opportunities uh, uh, to weigh in uh, in the end. I'm the chairman, uh, and I made that decision, and I did because uh, that's what you have to do uh, in these jobs. Is there any concern that you're going to get blowback, pushback from the Republicans who are going to take a look at this oh, and take a, look, take a look at the platform and say, look, you know, this last-minute change had to happen, that the Democrats themselves are either uh, a, a godless party or weak when it comes to Israel? Well, I wasn't weak in making the decision, I can tell you that, and the president wasn't weak in saying, I want that platform changed because it doesn't reflect my values. I think uh, they need to not expose themselves. Uh, Governor Romney was weak in not challenging his party on the issue uh, of the plank saying that uh, they oppose abortion even in the case of rape and incest. That's not the kind of leader that we want uh, leaving uh, the free world. I promise you, the president has a big stick. <laughs>